Hi everyone, hello and welcome to Happy Wednesday Dollar Tree Haul. I am here, we are back together and I am always so grateful, thankful and blessed to be here with every single one of you. I hope you all have had the most amazing couple of days since I saw you last on Happy Monday Dollar Tree Haul. I am back for another one. I have some amazing, amazing things I cannot wait to share with you. And so I wanna get started right away, but first and foremost, I wanna point out to you that it is the love month and I promised you guys that in this love month of February, I was gonna get a little extra for you guys outside of the box of me and my normal everyday self. Um, I put lashes on for you guys today. These are the lashes that I hauled for you guys somewhere within next uh, last week. And these were the uh, faux lashes with the purple tips. So I don't know how long I can leave my eyeglasses completely off. We will see where it takes us. Um, and I also put on the pretty woman nails, um, those faux nails that I told you I was going to put on and I put on the really light pink ones. So this is me and my extra self for this video of Dollar Tree hauled items and happy Valentine's Day month to you all. So I want to get started now. I have some great things and let's get into it because at the end you know I want to chat with you. Okay, so I have to show you these hearts. These hearts are my absolute, absolute favorite. Yes, they most certainly are. These are so stunningly beautiful. This is like a total beach type of theme. I love it. I love the hanging hearts. My mom is also going to love these. They come on this beautiful silver ribbon right here. So I picked them and this is just a nice thick piece. It's really structurally put together so, so well. I'm absolutely so thrilled by this. So I picked up three white ones right there. I also picked up three of the natural wood looking ones. How beautiful are these? Now think about for like a wedding, think about for, you know, Mother's Day, just to give a heart. My mom loves to hang things like this. She has a beach theme in her house and I will trickle these everywhere because they are just so pretty. So these would be really, really nice for decorations at a wedding though, for sure. Now I grabbed this beautiful gray one as well. So these were found in like the frame section at one of the Dollar Trees that I don't very frequently go to, but I was so happy I did this day. So I picked up three of each and I'm absolutely elated with those finds right there. Now with those, I was thinking to set up like a cute little area Look at this canvas right here. That canvas is so, so beautiful. I love all the vases, all the different styles of vases with the greenery and that beautiful gold accent coming out of all of them. Now those with these situated like on the side of it somewhere to show it off in like a display area, I think the hearts would look so pretty next to one of their beautiful canvases. So I love that. I love that so, so much. And then, and then, and then, and then I picked this up because I was also thinking, okay, I found a different scent in these hand soaps. So you know, you know that that makes me extra happy because I love, love, love hand soaps. And I hauled this in a different scent probably about two weeks ago now, I would say. And um, they have two new scents. So this one is beautiful in this jar. I love this jar so much. I'm going to keep it forever and ever and ever. This is the Vanilla Cookies Luxury Hand Soap and it is 13 fluid ounces. But that set next to even this by your kitchen sink or something like that, those two would look really, really cute together. It's a very like just natural, you know, just beautiful look, light and airy summertime vibes. I just, I thought it was great. Now to keep going with like kitchen type of talk here, I was loving, loving, loving these new hand towels and Matt, um, not Matt, but Mitt. And I think that these are just so simple and gorgeous, absolutely simple and gorgeous. And you know, I love the saying on them. So it says thankful and blessed. And I love the gingham print all over it. So I think I'm going to give these to my mom for sure, 
because this definitely goes with her house, her theme, her colors, everything. So I got this one and that is the first time I've ever, ever seen anything like this. Then this is the kitchen towel that is so beautiful and matches it. So beautifully pretty and nice just to dangle over the oven little handle there and decorate your kitchen. Usually I only get these to decorate with. Everybody and their brother knows, don't touch my pretty kitchen stuff. <laughs> so I, my mom does the same. And then this one right here, I am super duper extra th thrilled about. They had these in so many different colors. And this is a pot mitt, okay? It's 100% polyester. Back foam coating is 100% rubber. So that is really, really fantastic. So you put your little hand right on in here and you will be protected when you go to grab like a handle to a pan or anything like that. I'm telling you they had so many colors, but I definitely wanted to go with this color so that I could gift the oven mitt, the towel and this to my mom. Super duper beautiful, pretty. I love it. It's useful. So, so great. And she is going to think that that is pretty awesome too. Then, then, and then, and then I had to get this. This is not even my sign, but I know somebody that has this sign. I found this gorgeous, wonderful, marbleized looking mug right here with that gold trim all over it and it is the sign of a leo okay look at this mug how beautiful is that can you see all the colors running through it it is such a beautiful heavy nice mug i'm obsessed with mugs so they had these um they had the leos and they had virgos but i couldn't find any other signs i do know plenty of leos so i'm gonna drink in their honor because i really really just wanted this mug for myself and i don't even care because it is mine and i think it's so so beautiful it's deep it's big and nice and then i found these plates that are these you know this color this color is so beautiful. I did find it in some bigger plates as well, but I just got a smaller plate, like a little salad plate, so that I could sit the mug on top of it, maybe have a couple of little cookies on the side, and just enjoy some tea in the afternoon or something like that. I think it is pretty spiffy. So while I'm showing you this right here, I'm going to show you that I grabbed some tea and coffee cookies that I've never seen before either. So this right, right here is shortbread. And there is a four pack in here and it's from Global Brands. And so some cute little cookies on the side of your tea in the afternoon just for a little snack, maybe cut up some fresh strawberries, add a little dollop of whipped cream, and you could have like a small little shortbread strawberry shortcake moment while you're having your tea. I just thought it was really, really, really nice to pair together, even for gift purposes, honestly. That would be so cute for just those three things to give to somebody. So those are the things like I'm excited about all of it, but to show you that stuff, I could not wait for my honey bunny to come home today and um, for us to have our moment and then put this video together with you guys. Thank you also for all the love, the prayers and everything that you always do for us, just as our friends and extended family and everything, all the prayers, the love, all of it. It just means so incredibly much to Richie and I, our whole family. And um, he did go to the hospital just for a really, really short stay. He did so well because he recognized the signs super quick. He got better. He's home with us. We had our afternoon together. Now I'm here. I'm happy and we're making a video. So thank you guys so much for the prayers, the good vibes and all of that. Now I'm starting to not be able to see too, too well. <laughs> um, and I might need to read some stuff. So sorry, but I have to put my glasses on. <laughs> so we're going to just roll with this. Then I found, then I found this right here. I found this beautiful ice uh, cube 
tray, right? Yeah, ice cube tray with the lid. And so this one is something that I've never one time ever seen before at the Dollar Tree. And this is pretty magnificent. You just pour the water right inside of here. It will fill all of the cube area put it in the freezer and then you have ice cubes. You can make whatever you want. I can pour juice in there or something like that and make ice cubes out of juice for the summertime. This is so wonderful. I've never ever picked this up before. I don't know if it's a completely new product, but it is new to me. So I grabbed two of them and that is pretty awesome. They had so many really, really awesome, cute and beautiful things for like the kitchen section. I was going bananas. I was going wild. Now, boop, boop, boop. Where am I going? Where am I going? I'm going to go to these signs right here. These signs are so lovely. They're so beautiful. They are on the shorter side, which I really actually like a lot because they make the really long signs. And then this is a smaller version. And I think it's so stunningly pretty. Look at the beautiful pastels all through the coloring in this beautiful sign. And this says life is a beautiful journey. So that is the middle right there. And that bicycle is just too cute. And that beautiful bouquet is like an addition piece onto the board. But this is just absolutely stunning. I love it so much. I did take several pictures for you guys to share on my community tab, which will be right here on Crazy Days of Callan in the community tab section so that you can see other options that I found in the store that I didn't pick up, but that I think are just as great, you know, if you guys liked the other styles. Then there was this one right here. Look at that sweet little girl gnome right there. She is just too cute. I absolutely love her hat. Her hat is like an addition piece, you know, set onto the board. Her beautiful hairstyle, her outfit is perfection and I want to wear it. Um, all of her potted plants and it says grow with love. So this is just so cute. So cute and the flowers and everything, the colors to this. It's just the cutest ever. It's just they are doing some big things around that Dollar Tree with all of these new items and they are making me incredibly happy. Then I found, okay, so I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I feel so happy and relieved that my husband is home. It was a short stay and I'm so happy to just be sitting here with you lighthearted and ready to go. These are so cute and I'm going to do some crafting later to celebrate also. I found some brand new options in the Easter section for these little teeny tiny wooden cutouts in this, you know, DIY style. I love to make magnets out of this. And in the crafters square section, sometimes they do have little magnet sets where I just kind of hot paint these, hot glue them onto the magnets and stick them on the fridge. So here is this option. I love, I love every single one of the little wooden pieces in there. And there is, um, I believe, four of each one inside of the package. Four or three, I can't really tell. And then here is this one also. This again, really, really fun to just sit around with the kids and Easter activity, make magnets with them with those cute, sweet little wooden cutouts. It's just so much fun. I do miss having a teeny tiny little miniature boy that I just always did so many like artsy things with and crafts with and we would just have so much fun together doing that stuff and now he would still do it with me but it's not the same as when they're little and they think it's just like the most amazing thing on the planet but I still do it and think it is so I'll do it myself and maybe Richie will join me. Um, and then for Easter as well, this is a really, really cute movie to put in an Easter basket. This is so adorable. I love their movie section. It just is so incredible. Sheep and wolves, pig deal. That's what it says. It says you can't pull the wool over their eyes. Is that not sweet? And so the animation in it looks really, really adorable. I, I just myself cannot wait to watch this. The Three Little Pigs was my favorite 
favorite fairy tale growing up. It absolutely loved. Uh, I absolutely loved it. And fairy tale theater with Shelley Duvall is my hands down childhood from start to finish. All of them. Hansel and Gretel, The Little Mermaid, Cinderella, uh, uh, Rumple Stiltskin, The Three Little Pigs. I want to go get my fairy tale theater movies out and watch them later. So I cannot wait to watch that. I, I just know it's going to be great. Then, then, oh, then, then, my little darlings, I found some of these beautiful dangling pieces here. And with these beautiful dangling little signs or whatever you want to call them, decorations, I usually take these apart and then I hot glue them onto wreaths and use the pieces to embellish other crafts that I'm making. So here are all the pieces that are on this particular one, but there were other ones to choose from that were just as cute. I just really seriously loved the watering can outlined in the silver. So I had to pick that up for sure. I loved it so much. Then, in the spring line as well, look at this garland. This garland is so beautiful. I absolutely love it. It's these puffy little, little flowers, maybe not even little. They look quite big actually, but they are so cute. There are blue ones in there and little purple tassels and everything. Ooh, this is just so cute. I might keep it together as a garland, but I also might pull it apart and use it actually as embellishments for a wreath as well. You know me, I love making wreaths. I've said it a hundred times. It is one of my very, very favorite crafts to make. I just kind of load everything on there and place it, you know, in cute spots. And it always pulls together just the way I like it. <laughs> so then, then I found for St. Patrick's Day, because your girl over here is Irish, Italian, and probably 150 other things that I don't know about. But I picked up these two things to go together. I cannot wait. They had the cutest headbands. They actually had more than what I even hauled. But this one is definitely my favorite. I love that cute little tie on the top and all of the designs throughout the headband. So I had to grab that and I cannot wait to put it on. Then we have these fuzzy socks right here, the low cut ones. This is a size five to nine. And these are too cute for words. I cannot wait to scuff around in these on St. On Saint Patty's Day. I have so many things that I want to wear. I'm going to have to wear like St. Patrick's Day themed stuff for like the whole week. <laughs> so I can get through all my outfits. Then there was this beautiful headband. This is the second one that I chose. And I love the darker green and the emerald green look to it. So... These are really cute and to get a headband for $1.25 at this rate is a steal because you know me, I get nosy, I go to the other stores and I go look around and I'm like, wow, a headband is like seven, eight dollars even in Walmart. Even on clearance, I can't find them for less than four dollars. So that really breaks my heart because <laughs> sometimes I see cute ones and I absolutely will not pick it up if it's not a dollar twenty five. <laughs> so there's that. Then I found this. I found this. This is the felt garland. And it has rainbows and horseshoes all along it. I am so excited for this. This I'm absolutely positively going to pull apart. And I'm going to put one of each of the um, rainbows in every single one of my windows through my house. And that is what I'm going to show to the world as they're driving by my home. The rainbows in each window so I love that I was so happy to see that and the rainbows are so vibrant in that package then we have this garland right here with all of these beautiful shamrocks all together five feet of it that's a lot of shamrocks so this I may probably keep together because I would probably have to cut them apart and that would just be terrible because I don't want to ruin it. It's just so cute with those three different greens in there. So I love decorating and all of these things are going to come in handy for me. Um, and then, and then mustaches. There was no way, no how I couldn't pick these up. 
mustaches from the Dollar Tree was one of Isaiah's favorite, favorite things when it would be like dress up day at school for any reason. He would always want to go get a package of mustaches from the Dollar Tree. And so when I saw this, I had to have it because even if I put some of my like gnome characters out, I can throw a cute little mustache on them and I think it would be too adorable. This is 12 pack of these in here and there's a bunch of different styles of mustaches as an option. So 12, that's a good amount for $1.25. You could even send these to school on St. Patrick's Day as just like a cute little joke, you know, for the kids to all wear mustaches for the day for, you know, for that fun shenanigan type of day. So I love, 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 love those. Now, where do we go? I got my mom some beautiful, beautiful yarn. I'm going to show you all together if I can do it they have oh where'd the pink one go guys the pink one left the building so I'm going to show you the three of them together this is the color scheme that I was kind of thinking looked really really nice together I love the mauve the teal and this type of purple I think that these look so gorgeous together this is the just active right here and this is yarn I get for her all of the time and she usually knits me like shawls and things like that so that I could wrap it around my shoulders. And I just really, really love these three colors together. So I picked those up for her. Then I grabbed her this potted little, um, this little planting pot right here. I thought it would be so pretty to put outside of her door out, you know, while her, she's walking on her walkway. This one is gorgeous. I love love it i love the design all over it this is a really pretty style one it's really nice size as well i've never seen anything like it and there's a sturdiness to this one that is different than the other ones so i got this for her i can picture like a really vibrant bright bouquet for um you know springtime in there and i think it would really look nice outside for her then i bought this one for me and this is a big old pot and this looks like a gray kind of terracotta look but it is plastic the other one was plastic as well and this one is really really large i love i love the chalky look to it i just think it's really really pretty and even if i don't use it to like pot a plant i'm probably going to use it to maybe put some um you know yard little tools in there or something like that so that I can put it on the porch grab them when I need them when I'm gardening and going to be out front you know working on things and growing my mammoth sunflowers for August that the seed packets come from the Dollar Tree and they grow so so huge and I love them they're absolutely beautiful so I grabbed that then now for some actual like everyday type of items i do want to show you i finally found my favorite tuna packets on the planet these have gone up to a dollar 49 same exact brand same exact stuff this is a dollar 25 at the dollar tree this is the bumblebee brand and this is sun dried tomato and basil this one is so good the tuna in this packet you just have to slice off the top right there and there's a spoon inside to grab out all of the content and these are really really good on wraps so there are those and i can't wait to put those in the cabinet then i found these two items i did pick this one up again and then i grabbed these and the guys are loving them i'm especially loving this one which is the strawberry the strawberry the splendid strawberry there are six bars in here from the quaker chewy fruity fun granola bars and these are about three dollars a box at my local stores so i was really really happy like a dollar two dollars and 85 cents and they're a dollar 25 right now so really great for snack they're soft they're chewy and the strawberry is so yummy but I wanted to show you that I just found another one that is the amazing apple. And I can't have this one because it has cinnamon in it. Uh, cinnamon in it. And I have like a little allergy to cinnamon. 
uh, that I don't want to test out. So again, there's six bars in here. I picked up a couple of boxes for the guys. Isaiah especially loves Apple. So that is really like a cost saving little snack for the house for their lunch boxes and all of that. Now again, I picked up another box of these. Both guys are really enjoying these keto fat bombs. I bought several a couple of weeks ago and hauled them for you. So this is a repurchase. This is peanut butter chocolate and they think that they are fabulous this is um two grams of net carbs and there's zero added sugars in here so these are really working out well there's 14 little cups of peanut butter and chocolate in there and they love them they sure do love them especially richie because he loves peanut butter the most then I got my Richie, my Honey Bunny Boo. I got him his Jim Bean Bourbon Vanilla Coffee. And this is the four ounce one. And out of all of the coffees that he has tried from the Dollar Tree that I've hauled for you guys and showed you, this one is his absolute favorite. So when we found it the other day, he was like, put them all in the cart. He loves this one just a little bit more than all the rest, but he loves all the rest too. So so happy to have found those. Grabbed him a bunch. Sorry, I nudged you. Sorry, sorry, my little love muffins. Now, now, oh, now, lastly, but not least, we have four more things, and then we're going to do a little chat. Look at this. Look at this. This strong and soft toilet paper that they normally have in only a four-pack at the Dollar Tree. They have turned it into a pack of six. And I say that that is a really good deal for $1.25 for six of them, just as an emergency backup to have in case you're in a pinch. So I grabbed a couple of these because I like this toilet paper. I actually really and truly like this toilet paper. It is not, you know, it's not a problem at my house. So to find it in a six pack, you know, I had to grab it. Yes, I did. Then I wanted to show you, I did. I sure, sure did. I wanted to show you that I found a brand new softener. I've never one time ever seen before. This is a big old jug and it smells really yummy. This is fabric softener. And it is long lasting fragrance. And that is really so nice. This is 28.7 fluid ounces and it's violet bouquet. So you know me and my smells. I love to do laundry and make it smell so nice and then bring it home and make the whole house magical spelling, smelling. Then I found this. I found there's the other one. I thought I lost it. Now I got it back. This is the spiced apple luxury hand soap and this is the 13 fluid ounces and that beautiful gorgeous bottle that I'm keeping forever so this is the third one that I've found and I'm so happy to have those in my hand soap stash now last but certainly not least before the haul is over here is the Brillo Basics dish spray, dishwashing soap spray. It's fresh scent and it's 10 fluid ounces. And I can tell you that I really liked the palm olive um, spray. Uh, before that I grabbed for the dish spray, I liked it a lot. So I'm definitely willing to try the Brillo because Brillo is a great brand. And this is a smaller bottle, but I'm excited to see what it can do for my dishes. So I picked that up and I think getting cleaners and all that stuff for that price point is a steal of a deal and I love it because I can save some money and I clean like nobody's business around here. So that is it. That is it, my beautiful little people. Thank you so much for being here with me. I love you guys to the moon and the stars and the sky. If you are new here, hi, I'm Callan. I would love it if you'd stick around, stay, like, share, subscribe, comment down below, hit the bell notification so that you are aware of every single time that I upload a new video. Here on this channel, I do Dollar Tree hauls on Saturdays, Mondays, and Wednesdays, and I just love all your faces super duper much. So I would love it if you'd stick around and stay. And now for those of you that want to stay with me for those extra couple of minutes, I have some little teeny tiny dorables to show you, Disney dorables out of my collection. And I want to show them to you super duper fast to show you the frozen ones that I found this far in my collection stash. So I have an Olaf, that little cutie patootie and beautiful, beautiful Elsa. So there are those two. Then 
then oh then i have two other different um olafs look at how sweet and dear they are this one is partying i want to go party with this olaf right here he is looking like he is having the best day of his life and i want to come too so we have those then i found their little friends I got to tell you, these nails are kind of tricky. Your girl over here is not used to this shape of a nail. When I put nails on, that is for sure. I love them, but they're a little, they're a little making me crazy. Um, and then these two right here are like their little snowball friends. I can't remember what their names are, but they were too cute for words in the movie. And then we have her little, her little fancy friend, her little lizard friend. So that is what I have in the frozen line. And I love it. I love it so much. I do have to get some type of like shelving or something to display all of my Disney adorables. I'm having so much fun showing my whole collection to you guys. And I love it. Now, lastly, but not least, I told you guys last, uh, last haul that at the end of every video, I was going to show you a different page in my photo album that I ordered. For my husband Richie for his Valentine's Day present, we've already gone over the first page. And now here is the second page of our photo album book. So there are some more beautiful memories and moments with my wonderful, wonderful, amazing husband that I love so dearly. So every single end of the haul, you know, until the book is finished, I'm going to show you the pages within these books. And then this is the writing prompt book that came from the Dollar Tree as well. And, um, and this is the page that I showed you the last time. And then this next one right here is the second one in that I want to show you. So I'm going to read it to you. It says, the first thing I noticed about you, and this is where you fill it in. It says, was your love for kids and the kindness you expressed. Then it says, thing I thought when I met you, I wrote, he is a cutie with your one dimple. And then it says, thing I told my friends about you, this guy is going to be trouble in a good way. <laughs> So that's the second page in of the book. And um, I can't wait to give it to him for Valentine's Day. So that is it, my loves. I love you guys so incredibly much. Thank you for being here with me. And I will see you on happy Saturday Dollar Tree haul. I love all your faces. Bye guys.